Welcome back, everybody. This is episode 167 of the Top Series. I'm Toasty FM, and we have a cup semifinal today against Porto. We've played Porto just a couple days earlier, so let's look at that right now. Um, we're still second at the table, which is great. Uh, four points ahead of Porto, uh, three points behind of Benfica. As far as the schedule uh, goes, we played Seth Nance. We got the late victory, which is great. B Vitoria Gimenez 3-0. Uh, again, excellent. LEL was great. Torre got the goal. Uh, Becker got the goal as well. Um, Hiwa, we came back. Again, a uh, big game. Uh, Gide had his first uh, brace in a while. Um, he needed that especially. And then we came back um, against Porto, and, and we went up early. A little bit too early, I would say. We, we sat back a little bit too much. Uh, they came out right after the first half. Got a Got a goal there, um, which is a little bit uh, uh, disappointing considering I, you know, I told them, "Hey, man, we, you know, you got to be careful." Uh, but they got that that goal early on um, in the half, almost immediately from kickoff. Evander got that uh, go ahead goal in the 68th. Uh, but then Nicolas Aguirre got the 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 tying goal in the 85th minute. Excellently done. Uh, those two goals against Chihuahua probably definitely helped, and, uh, excellent, excellent done, and we got, we got a, a draw, uh, in Porto, which is an excellent result, uh, considering keeps us ahead of Porto, uh, keeps us, uh, within striking minutes distance of Benfica, uh, I would have loved the victory, I really would have, but considering all that happened, uh, the game was pretty even, I would say, so to get a draw, I'm not at all disappointed with that, and it puts us in a good situation today against Porto, um, uh, in a neutral location, uh, in Coimbra, uh, so probably, uh, we might get, considering it's our side of the country, uh, a little bit south of Porto, we might have, uh, plenty of fans in the stands, uh, but yeah, I think it'll be a 50-50 game, uh, they're slight favorites, I would say, but I don't know how, um, considering we beat them twice, uh, this season, we're ahead of them in the league. I think we were the better team. And it seems to me that we play well against the big teams. Maybe it's a it's a thing like we're maybe like a like a like a Liverpool uh, last year where uh, you know we we, we play well uh, against the big teams, struggle uh, with the with the smaller teams, and that's kind of been what's uh, been the struggle for us. Uh, so let's look, so let's get into the game. We have nothing really to talk about on the transfer front, and I'm hoping this will be, a, a two games in this episode. Um, uh, so yeah, guys, so let's, uh, let's get into the lineup. Alright, guys, so this lineup for today's game, um, our best 11, I think. Uh, Becker's in there, uh, Ochoa's getting a couple starts, but Becker's gonna get the start because he's been playing really well lately, and I think we need him in there. Um, overall, one big issue is that we have a lot of people on yellow cards. Um, and if they get a yellow card in this game, they might not make it to the final. Um, uh, but I'm going to play them because I'd rather risk them not being out there. Um, I'd rather risk them not being out there in the final than not making it to the final at all. Um, so yeah, I think this is best, best 11. Um, uh, I think we're going to be able to stand up face-to-face -face with Porto, with Porto. Um, against Porto, we didn't have uh, Almeida, and he's a big part uh, both defensively uh, and offensively. He's a great player uh, at that fullback position. I think we, him and Flavio Marcelo um, are probably the best fullbacks we've ever had um, in the save um, for the position we're currently at for the team we have as a whole. And, uh, and yeah, guys, I think it's going to be tough. It's going to be tough. There's no doubt in my mind. Um, but, but I think, I mean, we're, we're, we can do it. I think we can legitimately do it and, um, and get the victory. I really want this victory. Um, Porto are playing with their typical, you know, two deep, uh, playing midfielders. Um, which, which is kind of what they always do, um, from what I've seen from them recently, that's what they play, they play like that, um, midweek, or on the weekend, I think this game might be midweek, um, but yeah, here we go, here we go, big game, big game, big game, um, 
hoping to get back to the cup final. This I think this would be our third or, or fourth pass of the, the Liga final if we were to get there. Um, still haven't won it. I think we've lost both times to Braga, if I remember. Maybe once to Benfica. I'm not exactly sure, but it's something along those lines. And, um, and yeah, I mean, early, early the game so far, uh, it seems like both teams are a little bit nervous, not really doing much. Uh, they have um, more, they've had more of the ball so far, um, but haven't really been able to do much with it. Um, that's a great strike from Evander. Um, as we go down there, um, a really sublime finish from uh, Evander. He scored the go-ahead goal um, early on in the week, so he gets another goal there. Uh, I mean, a little bit of a, of a give-and-go here by Saith and Evander, and that's unstoppable strike. He dedicated a little bit too much time there. Uh, we had a lot of guys in the box. Um, but nobody came out to really challenge him. Um, so slightly disappointing. I, I think I think it's deserved with the amount of possession they've had. Uh, they've had more shots, but I don't think they've been out miles ahead of us in this game. I think we definitely have, to have a chance. Um, we may have to make some changes, um, but it's still early. Um, and then we'll go from there. Um, I'm a little bit disappointed we haven't come out as strongly as we may, um, as I may have wanted. Um, I'm definitely going to come out and I'm a little bit aggressive because I don't think they've given it um, all they can um, so far. So uh, this next 45 minutes is going to be huge um, for us. And um, we're gonna need to do something different. Um, I'm gonna give them ten minutes. See if the if the talk I gave them it was you know a little bit of motivation enough. Um, I guess not. I guess not. And it's just <sighs> typical. They they've really been they've really wanted this game pulled through. We have not. And um, they're having a really big game. I don't know if they, you know, put out a different side midweek or something. But um, yeah, it just not has not been good enough from us um, whatsoever. And um, and yeah, our front, our front four have not done anything. Uh, they have been non-existent. LEL looks terrible, completely off the pace. So does Aguide. Um, I'm I'm not sure why that is. Um, gonna make some changes, see if something can change, but it, it might just be a little bit too late for us. Um, that second goal for them was very disappointing. Um, we're going to see what happens here. Um, hopefully we can get a goal, get us back into this game. Um, I just, yeah, Marquez, I mean, I, we're playing our number from, I mean, if we're, it just seems like we're not up, like, I don't, I don't understand if we're not, it, it seems like we're playing our counterattacking formation. That's just what it seems like. It seems like, and then I'll make this gonna get a red card. Uh, completely terrible defending there. Not, not even close to his, to, to you know, close to who we should be marking. <clears throat> he blew past them. How to make a last ditch tackle, and um, that was the result. <sighs> um, Torres gonna come out there. Um, Just not even sure what to really do here. Uh, just brought on Swag. I'm not going to take him off. Um, I'll take off Braga. Just, I just don't, we're not going to, we're not going to finish. Um, we're not going to get out of this. We're not going to finish with the result here at all. 
Um, so just going to say face a little bit. Um, and go from there. Lick our wounds. Um, and try to, try to do, get the title this year. Finish the Champions League. Because, yeah, this... Yeah, the, this this cup is over. Um, we still we're still in the, in the Europa League. We're still in on um, the Tasa Portugal, but uh, it won't be the Tasa Liga this year. Um, wouldn't surprise me if we go three down here, and we do. Uh, they've just been class. Um, just not been good enough at, 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 from the team as a whole. Uh, Bad marking, really bad marking. Nothing going forward. Nobody to out pass to. Um, really disappointing. It's been really disappointing and uh, just silence on my part. Uh, I don't really know how much to say. It's just uh, I thought we had gotten over this. Um, at least, I mean, at least it's it's against the bigger side, a Porto side. At least we're not losing to some of the lower level sides in Portugal. Um, but still, I'm not really happy with that. Not happy with that. I think we're much better than this result. And, um, and, uh, they're going to hear about it for sure. Um, all the way around. Yeah, I'm just not, not happy with this result. All right, guys. So, I'm um, very disappointed with the way we played. Um, with that, I think we're going to come back against Braga. Um... Bank Fika, we have that's gonna be a massive game, man. That's gonna be a massive game. Uh, I'll play Braga just because then we're gonna be able to play um, uh, the second leg against Vila Real uh, in the Europa League, and I think that'll just work out better that way. Um, yeah, I'm still very frustrated with this game. I, I think I am. I, th I just thought we, I thought we'd come out a lot better. And uh, so yeah, guys, thank you guys for watching. Make sure you guys like and subscribe and to carry yourselves.